Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So earlier today I posted a video that um, Windows 11 version 22H2 had started receiving its first optional bug fix C release update on the 25th of October, which was KB5018496. And if you are still running a version 21H2 of Windows 11, Microsoft have also started rolling out the latest optional bug fix update for the month of October. And that's KB5018483, which will be an optional update appearing in this section on your Windows update page. And as I always suggest, and with the optional updates, only install them if you have experienced any issues with the operating system. If you are completely happy with how things are running, just ignore the update and leave it alone. Now, if you do decide to install the update, Windows 11 version 21H2, the, the operating system build will now be bumped up to, up to 22,000.1165. And this is more or less the same update I posted on a week ago when it was still in release preview, undergoing its final testing, and now has been made available to the stable version of Windows 11 version 21H2. And um, I did post a full video on that, um, but just to do a quick recap in case you missed that video, um, just to go through a couple of new improvements and some key bug fixes. Now the first new improvement is that they have added uh, um, improvements to the Windows search results and performance. So there should be a bit of a performance boost when you are getting those search results now in version 21H2. And then um, the same feature which rolled out uh, with the update in version 22H2 has now started to become available in version 21H2 and um, that's the task manager has been added to the context menu when you right click the taskbar. Now um, at this stage Microsoft says though that this is only rolling out in the coming weeks for version 21H2 so I have already received the feature in version 22H2 so if you're not seeing the task manager uh, setting in the right click context menu of the taskbar to open up the task manager as a quick shortcut um, I'm sure you will be getting it sooner than later, so just be a little bit patient. And um, that's a nice improvement for version 21H2 of Windows 11. Now, just to go through some quick important bug fixes, um, they've addressed an issue that causes an operating system upgrade to stop responding. That's been addressed. Um, they've also addressed an issue that was affecting the a task you schedule to run every two weeks. Um, they've also addressed an issue that affects Microsoft Direct 3D9 games and then also addressed graphical issues in games that use Microsoft D3D9 on some platforms. Um, there was an issue that was affecting the font of three Chinese characters that has been fixed. Internet Explorer mode has, has received two bug fixes. Um, they addressed an issue that was affecting the lasso uh, tool in graphic editing programs that's been addressed and then the final one just to mention this update stops the start of daylight saving time in Jordan at the end of October 2022 and um, the Jordan time zone will be will permanently shift now to the UTC plus three time zone so just take note of that so that's more or less the key highlights for update KB5018483 that was made available on the 25th of October for Windows 11 version 21H2. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.